Hey guys, welcome to Winged Terror Books. I'm your host, Michael Philippone. Today I'm going to talk to you about a book that I really liked. It's called Camera by Jean-Philippe Toussaint. It was... that's the cover, of course. That's the spine. That's the back. Uh, 122 pages. Very, very short novella. Uh, read it in a day. This was published in English translation by Dalkey Archive Press. I think it was published in 2008, but this book was originally written by Toussaint in uh, 1988, the year of my birth. I'm really aging myself there. Um, so this book, like I said, originally written in French. Dalkey publishes all of the English translations of uh, Jean-Philippe Toussaint in America. I think he has seven or eight books out right now by this point. Um, I actually just got this for um, the holidays, Christmas, Giftmas, if you will. Uh, I also got The Bathroom by Jean-Philippe Toussaint, also for Giftmas. But uh, I've had his book, Television. This is, I think, it, this is probably his longest book in uh, English translation. Uh, as of right now. It's like a typical novel length, um, 170 pages. I guess it's like short to uh, average novel length. I got this in the spring, I think in April, and I haven't read it yet. And I don't know why I haven't read it. I don't have a reason. But um, I read Camera, first one I've read from Jean-Philippe Toussaint. I really liked it. Really, really liked it. Like I said, I read it in a matter of a couple hours, and um, he does some really, really interesting things in this novella. Basically, um, it's about a guy, a young man, who um, falls in love, but it's totally not a typical love story. It's definitely not written as if this guy is um, in love. He's... Um, Totally original style, um, kind of hard to explain, uh, I guess it's very, everything's very compact, like, um, Toussaint will sum up a lot of, um, emotion in just a couple words, and he doesn't necessarily sum up a lot of, um, event, a lot of happenings in um, a few words, but emotion, the feelings, feelings, thoughts, a little bit of thoughts, mostly feelings, emotions, um, they're kind of just like written over, almost just like glazed over, like, like the happenings are important more than the feelings. And in that way, it's almost like the unre unreliable narrator because, um, because it's kind of just like everything Every big emotion, like I said, it's a love story. It's about a young man who falls in love with a young woman. And um, his love is like, it's almost like a joke. Like the, the novel, the way it's written, is almost like sarcasm in the way that it um, pays so much more attention to the things that, go, the things that happen. Very specific movements and locations. And um, totally just like blows by all the uh, emotional happenings. So when there when it, um, when there are words of emotion, it's like really really original things that I've never uh, a style I've never come across before. Um, I I totally sound like I'm just babbling on and on. Uh, I really like the book. Uh, basically, it's about a young man who wants to get his license, so he has to go to the DMV, and he, uh, there's the, a young woman working there who, um, it doesn't outrightly explain that he has a crush on her, but you kind of just need to, to fill in those, fill in those empty gaps there, like I said, like, uh, emotional aspects of the writing are just not there, um, not in a bad way, in a great way, actually, they're not there, you have to fill it in, um, you have to kind of like decide for yourself that this guy's falling in love. Um, so he he goes he meets this woman at the DMV, 
Um, they spend some time together. Um, they go out and drive together on a little mini adventure trying to um, fill up a propane tank. And then um, eventually they, they uh, without any kind of transition or segue at all, they're like, it talks about how they're lovers. They go, to, they go on a trip to London together. Um, and then they're on a boat. Basically, um, it gets its name camera because they're, they're on a, uh, I guess it's like a ferry boat. And um, he finds a camera, takes a bunch of pictures, and then disposes of the camera, keeps the film. Um, I'm totally just babbling on and on right now. Uh, basically, I'm trying to say I really like this book. Um, it's the first of many uh, Jean-Philippe Toussaint novels, novellas, uh, works I will be reading. Of course, I'll be reading television and the bathroom. So I'm really psyched about those, and I think he has at least four or five other works. Um, I'm going to pick them up and read them all. I really liked it. If you read it, tell me what you thought, and uh, I'll see you later.